Hello friends, this video on playing with numbers 526 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So now based on these concept of common factors and multiples, we will talk about some additional divisibility rules. So let us quickly look at some additional divisibility rules. If a number is divisible by another number, it is also divisible by each of its factors. Now let us understand each of these with examples. Now let us say we consider a number 248. Now we say that 248 is divisible by 8. Now we have found it by actual division that it is divisible by 8. So as per this rule that this number will become divisible by all the factors of 8. Now what are the factors of 8? So factors of 8 would be 1, 2, 4 and 8. Now if we say that 248 is divisible by 8, that by default means that 248 will be divisible by 1, 2, 4 and 8 also. So if a number is divisible by a particular number, then the number will also be divisible by all the factors of that particular number. Next rule. If a number is divisible by two co-prime numbers, then it is divisible by their product also. Now, this is interesting. Now let us take the example of 18. Now 18 is divisible by 2. Yes, we know that. 18 is also divisible by 3. Right? And 2 and 3 are co-prime numbers. Why are they co-prime? Because they have only one common factor and that is 1. So that is why they are co-prime numbers. So as per this rule, if 18 is divisible by 2, 18 is also divisible by 3 such that 2 and 3 are co-prime numbers, then 18 will also be divisible by product of the co-prime numbers. That means this would mean that 18 is divisible by 6 which is the product of these two co-prime numbers. So let us take another example. Let us consider the number 100. So 100 is divisible by 4, 100 is also divisible by 5 and what about 4 and 5? Do you think they are co-prime numbers? Yes, because they have only one common factor and that is 1. So therefore, 100 will also be divisible by product of 4 and 5 that is 20. So 100 will be divisible by 20. Next rule. If two given numbers are divisible by a number, then their sum is also divisible by that number. So let us say that we have a number 16. Now 16 is divisible by 8. We have another number say 32 and 32 is also divisible by 8. So we have two different numbers which are divisible by a same number. Now as per this rule, then the sum of these two numbers would also be divisible by 8. That means the sum of 32 and 16 which is equal to 48, then 48 will also be divisible by 8. So you see these are some very interesting rules of divisibility because with these rules you can very quickly uh, decide whether a particular number will be divisible by another number or not because till now we have told you the divisibility rules from number 2 till number 12. Now you might ask that uh, how do I know if a number is divisible by 12 or not if a number is divisible by 24 or not. So those are the places where these rules will be useful. So let's say you want to find out if a number will be divisible by 24 or or not. So find out if the number is divisible by the factors of 24. So that way you know you will be able to decide whether a number is divisible by a particular number. Rule number 4. If two given numbers are divisible by a number then their difference is also divisible by that number. So again let's take an example. Let's say 16 is divisible by 8. We take some other number now. Let's say 56 is also divisible by 8. So now when you look at the difference between 56 and 16 which is equal to 40, so this 40 is also divisible by 8.
So if two numbers are divisible by a particular number, then the sum of those numbers is also divisible. The difference of those two numbers is also divisible by 8. Thank you. Please visit examfear.com for free quality education. You can learn with a simple four-step learning process wherein you can watch video lessons, you can ask your questions, you can refer notes and you can take a free online test. We have content for class 6 to 12 on physics, chemistry, mathematics and biology along with practical videos. So please subscribe to our channel for daily updates. Thank you.